Well, we're at the K&N booth, and as you can see, wow, that is a big filter, and that is new for K&N. And Ryan Pelkey, he's going to be talking to the customer about that. We'll just listen in. Ryan, tell us more about this filter, this program, and what the benefit is to the uh, trucking industry. This is our uh, heavy-duty commercial-grade filter. Our commercial-grade filter for the k and side is actually different than what you're used to um, from the standard consumer filter. Our consumer filter is an oiled filter. This is an actual washable, reusable, dry filter, so there's no oil required. A big filter like this to try and dry it, it just takes you longer in that industry. Time is money. Get yes. that vehicle back on the road. Um, so the advantage to this filter is, uh, is, being that it's dry, it's a lofted synthetic media, so it traps and holds dirt much like our cotton gauze filter. Um, and the nice part about it is it actually helps save the, the uh, independent or the fleet money. When the trucking companies actually do oil analysis on the filters, they'll actually find that the silicone uh, deposits in the oil are actually reduced. And actually from the time they put it in, it will continue and continue to reduce is what we're, we're so far we're seeing. Um, but uh, service intervals on the filter, we recommend service interval every, when the restriction gauge reaches 15 inches of restriction. Um, mileage increase isn't something we can guarantee, but uh, customers so far uh, love it. We have some uh, independent fleets, uh, one's a FedEx independent carrier, and he currently uh, has, well he's got 25 trucks, and they've had him in for the last two years. Okay. So. Uh, right now he's servicing this particular style filter in a Cascadia truck like that with the inlet. He cleans it, uh, he rotates it four times because the box has a, a one single inlet. Okay. So he actually cleans the filter at 125,000 miles. That's awesome. So awesome. Awesome. this type of filter with that type of baseline, uh, the customer, he's looking at six Baldwin filters or six competitive filters. Um, so one K&N and 300,000 miles. So. Um, there's definitely a cost savings. Could be, I mean, I, I can estimate, but you're probably looking thousand bucks. You know, over yeah, the life well, of the, over, duty, yeah. over the life of the, over the life of the vehicle. Yeah. So if you figured a million miles somewhere, in there, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's, about, it's uh, my, yeah. dollar savings is hard to say because it depends on other things, but there is definitely a, a cost savings to them. So awesome, and uh, that this kind of filter doesn't going to have the same type of uh, cleaning like the regular car filter so it's going to no, be no there's no oil required there's no oil required no it still has a cleaning agent that's used cleaning, okay. so you can actually take light pressurized air and water to clean the filter so you so take so the filter be, it will be 10 minutes clean and put it put it back in and that's the filter this size you know probably 20 30 minutes tops basically you would rinse the filter from the inside out with a with a uh, low pressurized water uh, from a um, pressure washer per se, yeah. and blow it out that way. So then you take light pressure right there, blow it out, and then put it right back in. So you don't have to wait for it to actually dry. Yeah, so that's really a, a big enough hole there. You can get your pressure washing <laughs> exactly. out of it and, yeah. and kind of wiggle it around and blow everything out. Yeah, yeah. I can see where it would go you know, pretty quick to clean a filter like this. Yeah, you would definitely do regulated water. You wouldn't want to use 200 PSI on the filter, but you know, something around 30, 40 pounds. Yeah, the filter's back with a three-year, 300,000-mile warranty. So it's, that's decent. So it's awesome. over the life of the vehicle, you're definitely going to save, I mean, like I said, 300,000 miles, six filters. You figure a paper filter gets changed every 50,000 miles. So if you clean this every approximately 100 or 15 inches of restriction, you're saving you're saving some money. Well, it's saving money, saving time. Uh, this looks like a pretty win-win situation to me. What do you got? Uh, it's a win-win all the way. 